the girls the girls they fully cracked me honey they cracked me okay i'm not gonna hold y'all long i just had to get on here real, real, real quick to address a couple of things so um we go skip the intro we're just gonna get right into the tea okay baby we're getting right into the tea baby okay let's go run the clip peeps up and down the city i don't try to come for me hey. Woo! Okay, so first of all, as you know, on here we are a Gabby Hanna Stan channel. We are a Gabby Hanna Stan channel. Gabby Hanna can do no wrong, baby. Gabby Hanna can do no wrong. So first of all, I wanted to address, okay, BB Rexa. I'll put it right here. For those of you who do who do not know, for those of you who are out of the loop, BB Rexa, okay, released a new song called Sabotage, I believe and uh she came out with the video now the video is very reminiscent of gabby hannah's monster video that came out 2018 and it it is it, it's, it's very reminiscent i'm not blaming bb rexa but it, it addresses a bigger issue of i wish that music video directors because this is not the first time this is that this has happened this is something that happens all the time i'm gonna need for music video directors to stop stealing videos from previous videos like you're a director i'm gonna need for you to be creative if you're gonna draw inspiration okay that's fine that's fine you wanna you wanna draw inspiration you wanna... then okay that's fine draw inspiration Straight up, BB Rex's video for Sabotage was like, and I'm gonna, like, everybody's talking about the, how the video is heavily inspired by Gabby Hanna's monster video. I'm gonna go as far as to say that BB Rex's song, the whole song, the whole vibe, the whole everything was heavily influenced by not only the monster video, but the monster song. Go listen to both songs, go watch both videos, and y'all come back to me and tell me what y'all think. Let me let me let me let me know. Because what we're not gonna do, we're not, we're not gonna keep dragging Miss Gabby Hanna. We're not gonna keep pretending like somebody. I'm not gonna, I'm not I'm not, I'm not blaming Miss BB Rexa. I'm not blaming Miss Miss BB Rexa because I'm a BB Rexa fan. She has some great music. She's a great artist. And I feel like it's a cop out move for these music video directors because they kind of hide behind the scenes. Like they go behind the scenes and they steal these video ideas. And then the blame gets put on to the artist. How convenient. Because unless you know, you don't know. And a lot of people are not, unless you're in that world, unless you're in that atmosphere, you, especially young people, especially that, that target, that mark, most people who listen to BB Rexa are, are going to be in your, your, uh, 25 and younger group. You're going to be in your 25 and younger group and you're going to equate that similarity. You're going to blame it all on the artist. Y'all y'all get y'all get what I'm y'all get what I'm saying? So these video directors, these producers, these creators, these the the, the creatives part of the, the 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 aspect of the situation, the music videos, the, the lyrics and blah blah blah. Y'all get what y'all get what I'm saying? Like, unless you know the process of the behind the scenes work, you're going to blame the artist for copying. BB Rexa may not have any idea that that Hannah, that Gabby Hannah was of any influence. It is up to, to, to the creatives to articulate to her, to build this lexicon and to let her know that, hey, BB Rexa, we have this song for you. We have this video idea for you. Here is our inspiration. Now. The thing that kind of, that kind of caught me, that shook me, that, you know, like I said, B.B. Rexa may not have known as an artist, she's just kind of going by whatever her record label seller, whatever the director and whoever else is telling her, like, oh, okay, this is the vision, da, 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 da. She might not know who Gabby Hanna is as a YouTuber or whatever, but 
eventually like where is the responsibility to be like this is our inspiration da, 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 whatever okay so this is the thing that caught me so a lot of people automatically drew the connection before gabby said gabby said nothing gabby said nothing these are just regular everyday people people who made the connection between the two videos and was like hey this is very much like the monster video like what gives like what's up and bb works of you know like it got so much that it was caught so much attention that gabby had to acknowledge it and was like oh i'm not offended by it at all like it's cool like it's whatever it's more so on the director i don't think bb rexa tried to you know jock me or copy me or anything like that no like, no hard feelings i think it's a great song great video very very like professional pr like right so then bb rexa is like to be honest, I don't even know who she is, but I'm gonna listen now. Blah, 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 blah. So she, at first, she started out real cordial, right? This is the thing that got me. So I don't. I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. Y'all go on Twitter. Y'all do your own research. This is just me. This is just my vibe. This is what I got from it. At first, it started as two young ladies who were being very cordial with one another. Then it turned into. BB Rexa started quote tweeting people who were like shading Gabby. So she started, BB Rexa started quote tweeting people who were like, I can't even explain it. But she started quote tweeting people who were like being shady towards Gabby. So like, and get and BB Rexa's initial tweet, she was being like oh you know like oh i didn't know like i'm gonna listen to her blah, blah, blah. she was like real chill she was cool but then she started tweeting shit that was shady bitch why bitch why hold on let me y'all done got y'all done got me cracked tony y'all done got me cracked hold on let me get this let me get this little contour let me get this jaw contour honey let me get this jaw contour like if I if I if I feel like it, I'ma go back and grab the tweets. If not, y'all can y'all can y'all can go and look. Most of my Judy's most of my Judy's are active on Twitter, so y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Like why BB Rexa? Baby. Baby. You can't watch that video and tell me you might not have you might not have never heard of a Gabby Hanna. You might not have never never had a woulda shoulda coulda woulda heard of a monster video or a monster song or a Gabby Hanna or of a, of a YouTuber. And that's fine because that's what happens. You are the artist. You sing. You go on the songs. You sing the songs that the record label wants you to sing. You make the videos that the record labels want you to make the producers and the directors and the creatives tell you what to do you may not have not have known but why why be shady why be shady to another woman when when your video your song so clearly was inspired by monster now monster and i and i know i'm jumping around y'all but i'm just it, it gags me it gags me Okay, so Gabby Hanna's monster song is about uh, childhood trauma and growing up and, and having a difficult time and blah, 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 and, and wondering why, you know, just kind of like why relationships fail and that, blah, 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 this and that and the third. Sabotage, if it's not the same exact song, if it's not the same premise, and obviously, Obviously songs have the same ideas, have the same characteristics, have the same motives, have the same, like obviously, like right? But y'all my good Judy's. Y'all, y'all, y'all get what I'm saying. Y'all get what I'm saying. Somebody studied Miss Gabby Hanna, her lyrics, her music, her style, her everything. It was like, we don't want to sign her. We don't want to But this is a damn good concept. This is damn good writing. This is damn good song. 
we're gonna we're gonna give it to somebody who's already mainstream and and that is that that is common practice as well now and it's nothing wrong with drawing inspiration from other artists i'm not saying that it's the fact that bb rexa is over here like throwing shade like baby like baby girl I don't know if you have not listened to the song. I don't know if you if you have not listened uh, listened to or watch the monster video, but baby, it's very much the same vibes, and you have to step take a step back and, and like okay, and, and 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 ask your if you didn't know, ask your creative team, ask your creative team. Hey, are y'all familiar with Gabby Hanna? Have y'all listened to her work? Have y'all watched her video? It's very reminiscent to me. And then give props where props are due. Yes, obviously it's two different songs, it's two different rhymes. Look, I had to bring I had to bring the microphone out. Because it's one it's woman on woman crime. We need to be lifting each other up. And I just I don't get it. You know, you're BB Rexa, baby. I love you, but you quote tweeting tweets that are shading um, against Miss Gabby and alluding to the fact of, oh, she's crazy. Like, this video is nothing to like. Um, this video is, is like this. Oh, she doesn't own this. And da -da 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 -da. look, y'all, I'm not going to get all into the tea, and I'm too lazy to post up stuff like da -da -da -da. Go watch Gabby Hanna Monster, listen to it. Go download, stream, whatever, BB Rexa Sabotage. Listen to it, watch it. And and y'all let and y'all let, let let me know if I'm dead wrong. If I'm dead wrong, let me know, baby. Cause like I, cause like I said, this is this is a Gabby Hanna stand channel. We know this. We know this. I just we need to start holding this vi these video directors accountable, okay? We need to start holding these creatives accountable. And when you get called out for the similarities, stop leaving it on the artist. That shit is not fair. The artists do what the record label set them out to do. The artists do what the record labels assign them to do. And y'all are just leaving them out here for people to be like, oh, you stole from so-and-so, you copied them, you copied them. No, most of the time, let's be honest, these artists, don't, these artists don't know. Sometimes maybe they do. I don't believe BB Rexa knew that she was doing a song and a video that was reminiscent of Miss Gabby Hanna. She probably didn't know. But don't be shady. Be, don't be shady, be a lady. Don't be shady, be a lady. Don't be shady. The girls, the girls, the girls fully want to battle. The girls are shook. Horn, horn, horn. The girls are shook. They're here for better. They're here for what? The con, the con artistry, honey. The conspiracies of some foolery. Are y'all listening? Huh? Anyways, baby, um... I just had to get on here and speak my little piece about that a little bit of Gabby Hanna. There's a lot more drama and stuff going on. Uh, it was other stuff that I actually wanted to talk about, but I, I it, this video is already long enough. Anyways, let me know what you think about all the drama in the comment section down below. Uh, baby, press press the number two. Press the number two if you think I'm dead wrong. Go ahead and click the big red subscribe button. Uh, give this video a big fat sick. <laughs> thumbs up if you loved it and don't forget to click the post notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video and I will see you in the next video let me know what y'all think go watch it go for real go watch it go listen to it baby Gabby Hanna monster BB Rex and sabotage I might even I, if I feel like it I might even link it link it in the comment section down below baby Hold these video directors and creators responsible. If you are inspired, you need to put credit where credit is due. That's all I have for you uh, guys today. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. Woo! <laughs>